Hello and welcome to my final RTS uh, game of the season against Galen Lorem, aka Keshantri. Ah, uh, this is a rare treat since this is a tournament game against a strong opponent, 1811, at 30 minutes. So I get to rush it a little bit. Okay. Good hand, good hand, containment. Yeah, the Z standard setup, I think. I have socialist, so no threat there. And as I am quite a bit tired since I actually gave a paid twelve struggle lesson just a few two, less than two hours ago. I'm going to have to boost my hmm, Europe down, okay. Confidence and thinking skills, courtesy of Grimbergen. And I hate you already. Okay. Standard reply. Now, if I had either Decal or Vietnam Revolts, might have went for a counter coup, but as I have only D stone, and I complain about that, I probably should go to Malaysia first. Hey, and he went for Yugoslavia! Mm hmm. Hmm. Okay, smaller maybe, but that gives away some knowledge. Nah. Would have went for Cambridge coup if it wasn't actually with some strings attached to it. Should have went for the Cambridge coup. Okay, I really hope he's not a Indo-Pakistani war kind of guy, damn it. Yeah, blood the sink always works, doesn't it? Let's grab at least the space bonus. Hmm, I'm so happy out of that six. Turns out a three would have been better. <coughs> Give up socials here. <coughs> hmm. Do I want another coup? Do I want def cut? Yeah, I might. Because Lebanon now, the Afghan stays at 4 at the beginning of the new turn. Okay, so lesson learned. In the future, I should probably go for a safer Iran coup instead of Pakistan. And that's your fourth beer. And the 
this card is... Damn it. So, advantage Galen after the opening, that's for sure. Hmm, could purge him. Yeah, I like the idea. I know I could lose talent, but then again, Dico would cost me domination in Asia anyway. Yes, that Dico. Complaining about okay, I got the ops, but in the Pakistani war, free Middle East, free Europe, decal, come on. Truman is still around. So I probably should play the goal sooner rather than later. Okay, he's going for talent and he will get the domination of course. At least I'll have <coughs> the Milops Angola and Zaire. Okay, what are my chances of getting a draw here? As silly as this sounds, I probably have to ask. Okay, I'll grab South Korea. Ah, so much for Truman. Yeah, NATO's been played, so that can be delayed. In any case, it will be worthwhile to grab South Korea. Okay, with Vietnam, Malaysia and Philippines, I'm at 6, he's at 5. He might not have enough for the Dom, although of course he still scored big this turn. Yes, it practically requires a 4-op, which you might have, of course. A 4-op which is not US Japan, that is. And he did not have that. Still 3vp in his favor. Okay, the goal goes to space. That's the one. Oh, dominated again. Yeah, so far not horribly pleased. Okay, that is an improvement. Yeah, wait for CIA. Hmm, not cool. 
Let's hope he did not get socialists. Okay, I can live with that. In the Pakistani war again, of course, martial intervention. So, Ops A. Eh? at least the Africa situation is reasonable. I do wonder what should I do in the future regarding the turn one air one situation when he could me and I ran. I have great ops but none of the most important two accessors to talent region. Does that cost me a lot? Whoa, okay. S feels like I should create a threat instead of just securing Europe. Make him worry about something. All oh, right, he has Romania abdication. At least now he has to choose if he events the abdication. No, it's very reasonable. Europe has been scored already, after all. No reason for me to have it. Isn't there? Ah. <laughs> okay, so now I can, oh, I can probably take a bit of a break here space play everything else so I have four seven nine ops yeah I won't bother with the police I think two of this nine two four five six seven eight yeah and he has plenty of ops too <clears throat> Might go to Japan as well, actually. Okay. Ah, uh, maybe start with the smaller ones. Yeah, I probably have to take Japan. That goes to the Middle East, of course. I would, I would love to go to North Korea as well. Just break things up, but probably this has to wait. I'll just secure domination in Central, domination in Africa. Influence! Not entirely expected. One, two, hmm, three. Hmm, central, okay. 
I guess I'll dump that first, then I have Fidel, so that's relatively free to play after that. Of course, he could have Brush or IBM. Crap like that. But can't be helped, really. <coughs> what sucks is, of course, the gunman, and given that I have Quagmire, the Gold Fidel, and RP Trelli. Oopsie. Okay, that just got worse. Means I have to play the China card. That's generous. Asia, OPEC. No, but Korean War. One small step, of course. Arms race, certainly. That can wait. That means, by the way, I'm not playing Quagmire, of course. Awesome. Might as well play the China card immediately. As I'm definitely intending to hold two cards from this situation. And I'm really hoping he doesn't have the call. Okay, maybe I rushed with the China card played like this. Ay, 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 ay. Unfortunate. Okay. First things first, then. Since Italy is just too vulnerable in this situation. Hmm. Okay, I'll take that box, thank you. So I'll be stuck with Gunman and Fidel. Ay, ay, ay. Yeah, I can't really defend there. that that was the last of it although this game feels like I might need some reinforcements <coughs> okay luckily that didn't matter much that came late Our space is not that great, isn't it? Not sure I will delay Fidel for as long as possible. Asia already scored, so nothing to do about that. Interesting. Okay, I'll just take Israel. No mill-ups, alas. Better. Second cover was played already, or was it? Oh, it was not. But I don't expect we'll bury you from him. Middle East scoring is unfortunate. <coughs> okay, let's gamble. Damn it, I actually probably shouldn't have done that since 
I hold both these cards. <coughs> okay, Arab Israel War is gone for good. In the Pakistani War and Korean for now. So Flower Power is safe-ish to play. Hmm. Oh, he missed the coup then, I'm guessing. Yeah. Uh huh. Okay, that's flower power then. Now, hmm. Which one to space first? Oh, one important tidbit of information. He doesn't have a card higher than a 4-up. Sorry, higher than a 3-up, of course. <coughs> he does have that. Damn it! Oh, he actually accepts a coup. His rolls are oh shit. I would have used it probably against Nigeria if he hadn't cooed. Okay, now I expect he'll repair enough damage for it to not be my domination, but of course it will still be a draw. Somewhat annoyingly, I still don't have melops, although of course he did at least give me that. Muslim Ref. Yeah, not a fan of that. Hmm. Yeah, let's give it a try. Oh, come on! Am I really going to keep missing those? So, looks like everything hinges on the fate of South America. Interesting. Yeah, that didn't really work. Felt like I had tried though. Though really, really wish I uh, could have had Mr. Kennedy to help me out here. I think there's only one scoring left, so I can safely do that. Damn, girl! Now you're talking. I 
That probably wasn't best idea just to give me Kennedy when, well, I had obviously so much crap in my hand. Okay, I'll just take Nigeria back then. Hmm. Love it, love it, love it. And with brush and ABM gone, I can afford some serious action. I have Panama Canal return, so I don't need to worry about that. Yeah, I'm losing my position in Europe, I know. Okay. These rolls are slowly getting tiny bit unfair. Not to put it to find a point on it. Okay, he has enough to at least grab Italy. Okay. No, I'll just grab it with Formosan. Maybe he start to real starts to realign in Venezuela. Could happen, I guess. In which case, I got just the response for him. Right, he could have and whoa, really? Okay, Italy gets boosted. But in truth it does start to look for him as if he needed some serious luck here. Hmm, maybe I'll do something like this. Do I have enough for control? That's the main question. 246 I need. Yeah. First of all, Argentina instead. Five, no, might be not enough. I will spend one there, however, just to ask my noble opponent if he would be perhaps willing to spend some of his hard earned ops over there. Hmm. Yeah, that calls for the China card play, but then again... No, not yet. I know I'm risking it a lot in Europe. I expect he will have to give it mill ups here. Okay, I needed a coup anyway. Damn, okay, that's seriously unfair already. Chile is just two more VP. So I might not want to bother with that. Okay. Now I'll definitely not. <coughs> so it's Europe or bust for our friend. Europe Defcon or boss since Kennedy is gone and Gunman isn't. And well no amount of spacing will help me with that. 
Reshuffle will happen. NATO, okay. That's helpful. I'll just focus on France then. Middle East, grain sales, brush wood flower power, not that hot. Hmm. Okay, grain sales definitely the headline used against Iran, of course. Sort of ironically, it is the only uh, Kubel at DEFCON 3 target with. Hmm, naughty, naughty. Okay, game. Yep. Okay. <coughs> oh, oh. Games like this happen, I guess, and <laughs> the ending was pretty anticlimactic. I expected hard battle for Europe, maybe making a dent somewhere, but well, happens. So at least RTSL ended on a high, well, likewise note. And well, see you next season in a new and improved RTSL. Oh, and by the way, uh, if any of you is Polish, for people watching it, or a Polish citizen actually, then there will be a Polish National Championship played online from December. There will be a post about it on Reddit and the forums soon. So, cheers!